Yeah. Shit, that look good. Stink. Yeah. A lot better. Hell yeah. You can barely tell the 20s until you look at the actual rim. Yeah. See how this shit comes out. Since the first one was tight. I didn't try that one. Yeah, you want to be on it? Shut the hell up. You, you can take credit, credit on this one. I take credit on everything on that car, except for the fog lights. You say what? Everything except the fog lights, I've done. <laughs> hey, I help on this one at least. Yeah. So, the last How two. How you get them dents and scratches out? Who was that? The dent was you. <laughs> the first one you got, not the second one. You ain't done nothing to the second one. 20s! RT 20s! In and out like Donkey Kong said. Hey, you can say it. Are we faster than them right now? Yeah, because guess what? We are rednecks. Yeah, I guess I can't do it. Hey there, guys. Trying to show you the new wheels I got for the car today. Fun, an awesome guy that happened to give him for a pretty good deal. The only problem on these, well, it's not really a problem, but it's pretty good. They all look good. I uh, looked at them. There's no scuffs, marks, nothing like that, no scratches, except for this one right here. Got, let me see if I can find it, a little bit, not too much chunk taken out. I'm not even sure if you can see it. But there's like a little bit right there. And right there. Off the wheel. Chewed up a little bit. Not really chewed up. Or it's just a little bit. Looked like from like a carved or something. But that's the only one. So, just wanted to show you guys the new mod I did to it. Not really a mod, just an upgrade on wheel size. It's a 20 inch. They're Mopar OEM from Dodge. This came off of a 5.7 liter 2011 Dodge Challenger. Red. Car was red. Had uh, HID projectors on his. Very nice, good looking car he had. I'm from a guy here in Columbia named Josh. Not saying his last name, but as I can, I will post some pictures of what it looked like before. But this is what it looked like right now. I want to show you how it looked. The tires need to be replaced, so we'll be doing that in early in the morning tomorrow. Got me a good deal on some Indy 500 tires. Was trying to get the Falcons, but it will take a pretty long time for me to get those. They're out of stock completely here in South Carolina, so. And apparently the Indy 500s are a little bit better. They were a little bit more expensive, but they gave me a discount since I am doing it. 
early in the morning tomorrow since it's a little too late today to do them. They're already closing down right now. The shop. So they gave me a discount. These are, I believe, 245. 245, 45, 20s tires, 20-inch 20 rims on RT. We'll be getting the Indy 500 tires, 255s, 45, 20s. We'll post those also on this video after I show you how. Call show you how these were taken off not by me not taking credit on this one as he keeps complaining and saying all on the vids are his work but this one I am giving him credit brother Charles he can have this one on this vid We'll be showing pictures and small videos of taking it out. It was pain in the butt taking one tire, the very first tire. Because my wonderful Dodge dealer that I bought my car from over tightened the lugs on this side right here. Front right, front left passenger. Sorry. But. We figured out how to take them off after they tighten every single lug except for one lug the last lug of the last tire came off pretty easy but took him with a small portion help for me at least checking the car up and putting the lugs on the tires some took probably I say 20 25 minutes to him so Thanks, guy, for showing watching this vid. Hello there guys. Well, this morning I came back from the shop. Got my new Indy 500s. All brand new. 255s, 45s, R20s. Y'all can tell. Brand new from Firestone. All the way around. I don't know if y'all can tell, but a little bit wider. As much. Try to get the stickers off of it. They're wider than the older ones. The older ones you were not even being able to see them outside the fender.
They look huge in the front. But they look really, really good in the back. I was going to go with a 275. 40, 20. Not on this Indy 500, but they were going to give me some other ones, but... But they're not recommended since it was going to be a little bit too much. So, I didn't get those. They were giving me a good a good deal on these. Pretty good. So I got these instead. They, didn't have, they did not have the set at all in South Carolina. They told me it was going to take a few weeks or more to get the set that I wanted. Which it was the set of Falcons. But I'm happy with these. They've been tested at the racetrack in Charlotte. Not this car, but the tire. So they do have better performance on track. They tell me I'm. If I wanted to, I can go up there and test it out. Don't know about that yet. So, just wanted to show y'all a look of the new tires that I got for the new wheels. Thanks, guys. Scrap, vote, comment. Thanks.